Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So if you're watching this video on March 1st, today will be my anniversary, my 11th wedding Jeez. anniversary y'all so today I wanted to go ahead and just do a chit chat get ready with me video to kind of practice my look from when I go out with my husband or whatever chit chat you know what I'm saying do all that stuff so let's go ahead and cue the intro <laughs> First off, welcome. All my old time subbies, the Happy Curl Gang, the Rain Gang, Congregation. Welcome back for another video. Thank y'all for clicking on this video as well. So before I go ahead and get into the makeup, because you know I'm coming at you bare faced, stay mind. So before I go ahead and jump into this Get Ready With Me video, I want to say thank you to my friends over at Anna Luisa. They are sponsoring this video. Where you get a coin for that? I so like it. All right. Come on, Jesus, Holly. Y'all know, if you've been watching me, you guys may have picked up on the fact that I love customized pieces, jewelry, clothing. So I was so excited when Anna Luisa reached out to me to um, send me some pieces, and I was very taken aback <laughs> by this cross that they sent me and mom because they know that we are sanctified, filled, and washed. So really quick, Anna Luisa is a jewelry brand based in New York, and they offer everyday luxury. Holly. Their jewelry is hand crafted individually y'all and they offer a one-year warranty on every piece please check out their website i was blown away because i just love really really like simple pieces i'm not a very like i'll layer my pieces like you see here but i'm very simple with jewelry and i would love to rock this alone probably tomorrow on my date night because i'm holding acceptable and mind now most of their pieces are 14 karat gold and mind and they're designed by artists that have previously worked with brands like gucci and louis vuitton the packaging is super super cute super simple it came in this box that says anna luisa jewelry okay i say i'm very very simple so i like simple pieces i really like to have gold contrast with my diamonds <laughs> It got real diamonds in my ears, but I can dream. Hey, mom. So this would be my everyday wear. Always wear this because it is short, so I can layer it, which I really like. Now I'm thinking about wearing this on my date for my anniversary on tomorrow. Um, so we shall see you guys. Thank you again to my friends Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video. On okay. thank. So another reason I was so excited, y'all. <laughs> Your girl got sent a PR package from Cover Girl. Okay, I was like. So anyway, we're gonna be doing this video, um, which is a little bit different because I want to practice an eyeshadow look. Okay, <laughs> and I know you guys will keep it real with me. I want your critique. Okay, and mom. So like I said, Cover Girl has all of these. This is not even a quarter of what they sent me, but obviously I'm not gonna pull this out. Now none of these, none of this stuff is sponsored yet. <laughs> Anna Luisa did sponsor this video, which I've already stated, but just in case you didn't hear me. I'm using a Super C Brightening Serum by Urban Skinner X. I love this stuff. It's already halfway empty, um, but it's just really helpful in brightening my dark. Like I have hyperpigmentation. I have dark spots. Um, my moles are not dark spots. They're moles. Just want to say that. Okay. I'm going to take their Matte Ambition Mattifying Skin Primer, which is by CoverGirl. Um, and I really like this mattifier. I've only used it once. So, um, I've already moisturized and all that goodness. So, I really get oily in this section right here. One of my favorite eyebrow pencils, y'all, broke on me the other day. So, I gotta use this, which is the perfect brow pencil. I'll list everything down below in the description box. Um, but I can't talk to y'all right now while I did my brows. So I'm going to just go ahead and speed up this, this portion and play some cute music. So now that we got that out the way, you know what I'm saying? We got the cousins together because, you know, I don't believe that eyebrows should be, you know, sisters. They should be cousins because they're going to look alike, they're going to favor, they're not going to be the same. You feel what I'm saying? Okay. 
Watch out for the baby, 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 foundation um if i'm wearing foundation a lot of times i just wear concealer and then powder but it's just gonna give me like a little bit of a glow you feel what i'm saying it's a matte ambition um and i'm in the color i believe deep neutral it looks to be my color yeah that's my color hey so i'm gonna go ahead and obviously put on foundation because I'm going to wear a foundation on my date. Oh, look at that. It's like a perfect match. Come throw cover, girl. Watch out for the big girl. Big, big girl. Big girl. Big, big girl. Watch out for the big girl. Big, big girl. Watch out for the DJ flame it up. Big girl. Big, big, big. Watch out for the big, big girl. Big, big. That is like a really pretty match. <laughs> okay. Okay, cover girl. Okay. Do y'all know this is one of my favorite setting powders, which is the Sacha Buttercup. Um, we're not gonna judge my ash again. I mean, so I'm gonna go ahead and just set my smile lines because you know I talk a lot. You learn the spirit of the hush. <laughs> and normally I would use my fine Pro Conceal, which is my favorite concealer, which is um, by LA Girl. But I'm gonna go ahead and use the CoverGirl um, All Day Idol Brightening Concealer. For the BJ flaming up. Big girl. Big. Watch out for the big, big girl. Oh, y'all, remember this hair? Mm -hmm. It's mine. This is from the Wetline Extreme Gel video. I just didn't feel like doing my hair over, so I'm about to wear it in a ponytail or puff tomorrow, unless I end up doing it over again, but you know. So this concealer is all right. It's all right. I'm gonna let it kind of dry down a little bit just to get more coverage underneath my eyes. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my Sacha Buttercup again and we gotta immediately set the under eye. We don't play, okay? And I got this tip from Ellery. She doesn't, I, I believe she doesn't bake. She just, you know, puts the setting powder underneath and then she presses it into the skin, which is what I got that tip from because it just works so much better and it lasts much longer and it just looks better in pictures. So. I just take the time to press, you know, the powder in instead of sweeping it off like I used to do. Y'all, I really want to go live on YouTube. Um, I've been trying to go live more on Instagram just because it's just easier. Y'all seem to really enjoy my lives, which I'm glad because I be feeling like they born this heck. But y'all be like, no sis, we have fun. Like, Keep talking, blah, blah, blah. So, you know, I just be like, okay. Powder on the outside and just kind of leave it like this because, you know, I be seeing like makeup people do this, or whatever. Because, you know, fallout is going to happen, I'm sure. And I don't want the drama in my life. And I'm not really about colors like this. So, I ain't gonna do that to myself. I'm not gonna do that to myself. This is really pretty as well, but I'm not gonna do that to myself either. This is the palette. For me, okay, it has a lot of browns, mauve, really, really, really pretty colors. Hmm, so what am I gonna do? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take this color. I'm gonna go ahead and take this color. Ooh, it's so pretty. Oh, 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 okay. That is pretty. Oh, and I'm just okay. I'm gonna use their Correct and Contour, which is cream based. Okay, now I do have oily skin, but because I have moles and textured skin, it's just better if I go ahead and use creams. So I'm gonna just take my finger on the darker shade. And we're gonna go ahead and just contour it up. And Take about five pounds off my face, ain't mine. I always get my hairline 
Beat it up like big girl, 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 big girl,
But, um, you know, as I've gotten older, it's just kind of like you become more accepting and you just, you know, you see your beauty. It makes me so self-conscious wearing highlight um, because it does emphasize my moles, but I don't care no more. I'm gonna highlight. All you gotta do is just dab it and then shake it and your highlight is, oh, did I blind you? I'm gonna just take the rest. Oh my God, y'all, like, wait a minute. You gotta be careful, y'all. Careful. I ain't trying to blind just everybody. So I think I'm gonna take some of this highlight shade and put it in, the, like I really want this center to pop. But this is really, it's really pretty, right? The lip, I think I'm gonna do this NYX pencil in deep purple. Can't find my sharpener, so. Last through eating, through drinks, all that good stuff. It's the NYX or the NYX, people pronounce it differently, um, in the color deep purple. So I guess my look, y'all, is going to be in the purple family. I didn't plan that. What y'all think? This is the final look. Pretty. I like it. It's cute. It's cute. I think I'm probably going to put on a brown lip. It's just... A lot of color on my face right now <laughs> and y'all know I don't really do all of this it may seem like so minimal to a lot of people but for me you know I don't really do like the home eyeshadow biz night but let me know your thoughts I think I'm gonna switch the lip and, you know of course do it better tomorrow like, I need to sharpen it and all that stuff so we're not judging that we're judging the eyes okay um probably not gonna wear any lashes just don't really want to but yeah y'all like what do you think i'm probably gonna want my hair back into a ponytail like, we're doing simple switches okay simple switches i don't ever really wear my hair back like this like ever unless we going to the gym or something like that i don't wear headbands i'm not gonna wear a headband tomorrow but i don't know if i want to put my hair up or yeah it's not gonna be down because this is the gel the crunchy gel so yeah i'm probably just gonna leave it in a ponytail i'll fix it okay but yeah mainly i wanted to know what you guys thought about my eyes i'm definitely gonna go ahead and see about getting my nails done i'm gonna make sure i wear lotion a month yeah i just wanted to practice you know the eye the eye look for my anniversary um so yeah let me know what you guys think more than likely we're all black but i think i want to switch to a brown lip oh i'm excited yeah, this is really fun. Uh, I know this is a very different video from what you guys are used to seeing, but I love makeup. I've always loved makeup. I'm very simple with it, but I love it. So I'm going to start incorporating some more makeup looks um, in my videos. Cuff a girl, girl was like, I'm about to send you something. I uh, mean, maybe that's just a sign from Jesus or whatever. I think about it like, oh, I should really like, you know, start doing more makeup on my channel. People ask me how do I do A, B, and C, and I'm just really, you know, simple and basic. And I feel like YouTube is filled with a lot of the elaborate, you know, people who are really into eyeshadows and just A, B, and C, and I'm the complete opposite. There's nothing wrong with that. I like makeup, but I'm just not into the whole eyeshadow game. I'm not into that, and there's other people that are not into that either. So I figured, why not just stick to being myself? Like, I've been doing a month, kind of showcase what I like to wear on my face and this is like my you know date night look like to, to get your opinion get your you know what you guys thought about this be honest you know you gonna hurt my feelings or whatever um about my eyeshadow and stuff like that make sure that you are subscribed to this channel sis okay if you're not subscribed this is a problem it's a problem okay um yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i appreciate you guys so very much see you guys in my next video i love y'all